I'm Santiago. I live in the Western Cape in Rosenville on a farm called Pokerel. It was an exciting day for me to learn new things. I've never handled a video camera before myself. It was my first time making a film in I can't wait for tomorrow. I'm still slightly confused about how I'm going to use PV, but I'm really looking forward to figuring it out. I would like to know what is the difference? Why is it the case? Why does it happen like that? We, we tell the people it must, it must be reported when someone was raped. Eva, sometimes we find that uh, it's quite difficult to get women to come. You know, why do some people feel powerless? I think my head is starting to really raise different ideas. I'm going to do this baby on the girls and the family, friends, and talk about teens' pregnancy. This can help us and they make a space to the community. I love everything that I always learn new things, especially in TV, you always learn new things. You just do one thing. to send Wendolins to the group who are sick with HIV, kids are sick with TB. Yeah, it really touched my heart that they don't have any houses, proper houses, and they don't have enough food, no job. But what I really loved is just that they did enjoy touching the camera. <laughs> I finally look shallow mud or cool and drink gum. And the engine to end Kalangayo, a man's Injang Shalagiona ear vuza, Injang Shalagiona ear vuza, and a ma windy, and nine go was oglala, Jenezinju, a slag zone, I lung ill. Status a pisnatcher look linking a slang of his and a nine. She are cool. Siakul, yin, a toilet. Go manjang men and a janganuga, no macalen, gakula myself. Kinen king and get a treatment. Jalong selling a cracker egg clinic. You can see they are really learning and they love what they are doing. It was a great feeling to see that success happening, um, not only for myself, but also for people who never ever would have actually had a camera in their hand if it wasn't for us today to bring it to them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it really. It's raining.
Hey, my name is Samkel Siam Kize, but most of the people they used to call me Semi. Um, this is resource center. Community issues. Let's do this. This is a good topic, I think so. Then Nizo enjoy Makaya. So I wanna see. It was an eye opener to see the Moloini community and uh, the settlement and how it is. And to hear some of the stories about this particular community and the disasters that have happened in that community and just see how the people live there. It was also quite an eye-opener to see the youth there and how enthusiastic they were about using the camera and how they just took to the camera as a tool. We see the youth there in the community and how they are using the camera 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 what more can I say? We're on a mission. And this is Moloini, Talk of Revolution, Black Power to all Black people. Canada, we are coming there. My name is Cynthia. My surname is Bumpan. I intend to be an economist or a, a professional teacher. The chartered accountant. If I were to be an animal, I would like to be a springbok. The reason why is because I love being a South African, and springbok is a South African animal. They were so excited to see what they can do about the camera. Subbingele spin the squam gale babkumal, and jingle long along parato pin the bumzali, Gabelu Pataranjan, the Ulami Colin. How can you say this mountain is too high? Or don't try to climb it. How can you say this life is too difficult? Or don't try to live it. Really great to finally get to see um, PV action. We are not a participant, and what it would be like to um, when we actually do get out there and, and have to train people. Um, but being a facilitator, by blood, by, by nature, um, I really did enjoy it and I can't wait to try it out in my own school.
Kuna kuti kunyika kwedu zvaka fana ne kunyika kwedu. Wakadzo wakuru sezvo makaita izvi kuti munzi mburita chihure mbozva zvinonyadzisa iri. Zvinonyadzisa. Asi ndikapinda muno mune munhu asingandi ziwe. Kana kuti ndikapinda muno ndotanga tomisa kana moto aenda tiona pa boda. Ndoimisa. Ndokona uchida because hapana munhu anondi ziwe. Chaifine Because I like that sound. How, how, how? It's actually bullying. Has been a problem ever been better for so much, but to sing a band as he noticed by your problem. Yes, I got every day. Yes, I got every day. This is a papa and so I'll be Kylie chanting at every day. Hey, a band to bang a report a man lent on a funeral report or bonnet who goes a in and sky. Oh, yes, a bonnet if no report or square. Phone is as big colors of value. We have to stand on the street. We have to stand it was a swar leading for me, I had to make a stay. I had alles to do with my husband and so on. When it was my life, it was a whole lot of other things in my life. I had to be a little bit of a kid, a man who had been born. Every week, I had to be a little bit of a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid. It was an amazing experience to work with all these women who you could see uh, some of them came from very difficult circumstances and how they uh, felt this was an empowering process. You could see the growth and empowerment happening and the behavior change. The women start talking about their own issues and some of the women said that I didn't know that is what your experience is 
and we love on one farm. And it was shocking to hear that because they are loving on one farm, but they don't know what's going on in each other's lives. Another big thing is the whole um, changing their attitudes or how they thought about sexual bullying and the fact that some of them didn't think that there was anything wrong with it. The woman speak about the, um, the problems and also find solutions as a group. They were taking uh, ownership of uh, the issues and uh, trying to educate the community. I didn't really think that the stuff that I was doing was making that big of an impact until I received the feedback from other people. So that gave me, in a sense, a renewed feeling of pride. It was very amazing for me to see the, the expressions on their faces. And even when we played it at our event, you could see how they were stronger women than they were when we went into the community on the first day. creating a space for the voiceless. TV is a method of identifying a problem, solutions, ideas, and suggestions by people affected through interviews and discussion using video with their consent. TV is about the process, individual and community transformation. After stage two, after meeting the project, I could see how powerful tool TV can be. Participatory video for me has opened up a whole new way of uh, connecting and sharing with uh, other human beings. I would also really recommend it to people, to other organizations, on and what powerful tool it is. I was sent on a lot of trainings by organizations and at the end of the day it was like you come back but you can't go into the community or the thing to improve. You didn't feel like you were left alone during stage two. Um, we always knew that we could count on feedback from Emily, Gareth and Neville. This was the only project that I could go back and improve. PV is for me because I like working with people. And I really want to do PV. Yeah, PV is something that I've become passionate about. I would love to be a PV, just a PV facilitator. PV definitely is for me. I don't think that I know PV is for me.